Seoul is a city overflowing with creative expression. The university neighborhood, affectionately known as Hongdae, sizzles and pops. Its clubs and hotspots resonate with the new vibes. It's here that A students meet with B boys, spontaneously giving birth to the exciting youth culture that is sweeping Seoul. Jihoon Jung was influenced by this culture, but grew up far from its bright lights. On the streets close to Xinchan, a young boy was addicted to dance and dreamed of becoming a star. Today, though, Jihoon takes a stroll down memory lane. Although he remembers his old neighborhood with affection, Jihoon's childhood was hard. 매우 남자답고 거칠게 자랐죠. 싸움도 많이 했어요. 네. 이 얼굴도 보시면 이게 코뼈가 이렇게 올라와 있는데 그래서 싸움을 많이 해서 이렇게 막 뼈도 많이 다치고 막 그랬었어요. 아 돈이 없어서 밥을 못 먹었을 때 그냥 굶었죠. 뭐 방법이 없었어. 그냥 굶었죠. 길거리에서도 막 잡았었고 노숙을 해봤었고 굉장히 많은 시련이 있었는데. 음, 춤 때문에 아, 외롭지는 않았어요. Jihoon's passion for dancing got him noticed. At the age of 16, he was picked up by a budding boy band called Fan Club. Lead singer Ho Sung Kim remembers he wasn't their first choice. We need a beat. 중에서는 진짜 제일 어떻게 보면 노래도 못하고 랩도 못하는 친구였었거든요. 한 3개월, 4개월 지나고 나니까 저를 따라잡기 시작을 한 거예요. 하다 보니까 점점 이제 지훈이가 저를 이렇게 앞서 나가기 시작을 하더라고요. 고생을 정말 많이 했어요, 그때도. 연습실에 가둬놓고 이렇게 문을 잠가 버렸어요. 못 나가게 춤 연습만 하라고 밥도 안 주고 한 10시간 동안 거의 사육 당하시다시피 했었어요. Although they made two albums, the company backing fan club dissolved, and Jihoon found himself back on the streets. 밴드가 실패하고 나서 이제 혼자 아 이렇게 오디션을 보게 됐죠. 음, 그래서 막. 정말 많은 오디션을 본것 같아요. 근데 아무도 저에게 기회를 주질 않는 거예요. 음. Chance came with JYP. Jin Young Park is one of Korea's most famous singers and dancers. More importantly, for the young Jihoon, Park's Academy was scouting for new talent. He went to 18 other companies before my company. And when he came in, I was shocked by how desperate this kid looks. Usually, kids come in like a normal kid. He came in like a, like a tiger who, who's about to starve to death. So... He had this pride in him, but he was mad at the world. So, I was just like, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm
온몸이 땀으로 범벅되고 음, 아주 어려운 그런 오디션을 봤었죠 근데도 저는 그것이 저에게 있어서는 일, 일생일대의 기회일 것 같았어요 근데 저는 아직도 의문이에요 그왜 굳이 3, 4시간 정도 3, 4시간씩 춤을 안 추게 됐을 텐데 I knew I'm gonna pick him as soon as he walked in the door The audition went like two hours long I think I said do this, try this, try that, try this, try that How about that? How about try this? So two hours long and then I said okay Maybe the company will contact you 오디션에 합격을 한 뒤에 그것이 끝이 아니었어요 아, 일주일에 한 번씩 시험을 또 봤었고 하루에 3시간씩 노래 연습을 했고 하루에 6시간씩 춤 연습을 했고 그래서 하루에 한 9시간씩 계속 연습에 연습에 연습을 했던 것 같아요 But I was really really mean to him I knew he had the talent so I was really worried that he might think he's bad so he don't have to practice so I was nice to everybody but him 그때랑 그 다음에 너희 간주 끝나고 이거 걸어 나올 때 있지 근데 몸이 어디 앞이야 뭐야 오케이 수고했어 자 잠깐은 지금 이동할게요 진영이 형은 되게 완벽하신 분이에요 진짜 조금이라도 뭔가 좀더 나아지는 모습이 보이면 그걸 삭제하고서라도 새로운 걸 다시 만들어내신 분이에요 어쩌면 진영이 형보다 몇년 후에는 진영이 형보다 앞서는 그런 프로듀서도 되는 게제 꿈이 음, 하지만 지금은 네, 지, 어, 가수라는 타이틀로 진영이 형을 이기고 싶어요 In 2002, Seoul came of age. World Cup fever gripped the host city, and national pride was at an all-time high. Into this heady mix, a new album was launched. Napu Namja, Bad Guy, was released under Ji Hoon's new name, Rain. It came after years of relentless training. But j i o n 남들보다 잠자는 시간을 줄였어요. 그러니까 남들이 일곱 시간 자면 자기는 여섯 시간 다섯 시간만 자고 그거 볼 때마다 와, 저 친구는 진짜 진짜 뭔가 되겠다. Ji Hoon's motivation to work hard came from an unfolding tragedy at home. Yeah, the motivation was just really desperate. But I didn't know. I didn't know until that day, Rain came to me and said, Hyung, I'm like, what? Said, Can you help me? I knew something was terribly wrong about him. He said, what? My mom's sick. I'm like, why did you tell me? Why did you tell me this now? Hop in the car. So I... I personally drove the car to his house and then this, this small house had a cold floor with no heating and his mom was lying in a cold floor and I'm like and she had diabetes like I wanted to like kill Rain for not telling me this So I put her in my car, I drove to the biggest hospital in Korea, but I found out it was already a little too late. <laughs>